Hey guys, what's up? We're back here with the latest episode of the Godric Manson My Player Season. As you can see here, we are just on our way to the car place to pick up our brand new car. And later on in this episode, we're going to be playing against Genk in the first game in the Euro League. And then we are going to be playing against Norwich, as you can see there. As you can see as well in the distance, there is our car ready and waiting for us. The BMW i8, just like you guys asked for. I actually put on a bunch of mods on it as well and got them to install them all for me so that I could purchase it looking a bit sharper a bit more power a bit more everything it just looks so cool so this is what our car is now that costs 200 grand with all the added bits on from that 104 grand so it's an extra 100 grand for all the extras and it's got a lot of extras in it so it looks pretty awesome white with black i couldn't color the rims sorry for anyone who wanted the rims colored it just wouldn't let me do it permanently but as you can see here we've got our bmw i8 as our new car as well as our ferrari and we're gonna head off now in preparation for our first game in the Euro Europa League against Genk. As you can see, they're second place with two points. We're currently top with six points. And we aren't actually doing too well in the score sheets at the moment. 15th is Hazard with two goals. But other than that, we're not on the list. But Manston, myself, for the assists, as top of the table with three. So let's hope we can keep adding to that and get even more assists to push even further up. We're currently sitting third still in the squad rankings for Chelsea. And as you can see here in our Euro League, we've made two appearances, three assists, which is pretty damn good. This is the last game of the first like, round of the Euro Leagues. And then we're going to do all the opposite fixtures for the last three to finish this all off. As you can see here, though, coming into Genk at home, their Belgian team, Chelsea from England. And this is going to be a big, big game for us. If we can get three points here, we can secure our place even more. Because look, at the moment, there's a win for uh, a draw for Vadas, a draw for Rosenberg, and two for Genk. So no one's actually won yet except for Chelsea, which is really good to see. Players to watch is Hazard. He is on absolutely phenomenal form this season. And we've got Costa starting alongside us up top with Van Ginkel, Mikel, and Paslic in the midfield and a few of the usual defenders at the back we're actually got a pretty solid squad this season so it's good to see and see hopefully we can push on and get some results we're still sitting pretty high in the premier league as well which is really really cool as well as this cup and we're going through the rounds of the cup in the efl cup and we haven't even started the fa cup yet so we've got lots of lots of things to play for this season guys so please like share subscribe 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 and share this series because i really want to get you guys to see it get more people seeing it and share it around as much as possible but here we are now in this game against genk genk with the ball now just passing it around there midfield trying to get it forward here with a great chance there through the middle good good shot there easy save for the goalkeeper and here we come on an attack for the first real attack of the game 14 minutes played manson getting on the ball now trying to turn it around the defenders great tackle into the box then not getting tackled sorry and Manson can't quite get it away. It gets punched away there. And comes to nothing. 25th minute. Genk on the attack. And now making their way up the left wing. Cutting it in central. Can they work it in the box? Back to the left wing. Crossing it in now. Can they get ahead or they can? But Courtois would made a nice easy save there. And did his job well. Here come Genk now. Trying to get past the Chelsea defence. But not breaking through that time. And Chelsea make their way out of the box. Giving it back there to the Genk players. Who's going to have a shot at the edge of the box there. Good save from Courtois. Who's had to push that one out for a corner. 33rd minute and here comes Manson now with an attack for Chelsea great touch around the corner Manson with a perfect opportunity to make this 1-0 here in the 36th minute of the game can we score here Manson to make it 1-0 and he's just been tackled at the last last second just as I was about to shoot there got that tackle in from the Genk defender they've stopped us coming into half time very soon easy shot there for Courtois to save and here we come now on the ball is Chelsea just playing it around nicely trying to hold it up the play laying it off their central losing the ball to these Genk players and they're going to go and go into the halftime break at nil nil very very good game so far guys there was quite a bit of action especially Genk having a good few chances Chelsea couldn't quite convert that one chance the Manson had just got tackled then and Genk had the majority of chances in this half but here we are with the second half now hopefully we can get a result and push on and get a goal at some point in this game to give us the lead and get us nine points up on that table and push even further ahead here comes Manson now making a bit of space on the right wing trying to get across in there gets blocked goes out for a corner kick here comes the corner now can we put this into the box here Manson lurking on the edge of the box near post there no one can cut go down to it but we've got it in the midfield laying it to Manson Manson making his way in the box here can we get him cut inside here we go lay off to Thiago Thiago with the left foot shot Thiago's gone and scored his goal Manson's assist that's Manson's fourth assist in the Europa League that puts him top of the table by one assist 
Thiago goes and scores his goal. He started this game. He's playing really well. And what a... Oh, he came on. Sorry, he just came on as a sub. I just remember. He came on as a sub just now. And that's his first real thing doing in this game. Look at that pass from Manson. One touch round. One touch with his left foot into the bottom left-hand corner. Thiago's gone and scored to make it 1-0 here against Genk. What a goal. What a start for him just coming on off the bench and he's gone and showing the manager why he should be stunning this game giving him a hug there as well thanking him for the opportunities and here we are that's the second euro league goal of the campaign as well so he's doing pretty well seeing as he hasn't been starting many games and that's really really good for him good assist though for manson as well putting myself top of the table for the assist but here comes genk now on the attack now can they work it from the right wing into the box here they've got a bit of space crossing it in here near post what a good opportunity that was to go 1-1 and they missed it unlucky for them here we come now though a couple minutes later 67 minutes manson making his way up the right wing can we get it in the box now? Great little turn there from Manson trying to work his skills and getting into the box. And he's just been tackled then. I've been put down injured, but nothing happened with that injury. We're still playing on. Here comes Manson now making his way in the box. Great through ball there to Al Salsa, who's out the shot. Al Salsa just coming on as well. Having a shot there. Great save from the goalkeeper and it gets denied. Here comes Manson now, though, 76 minutes play, pushing his way up the right wing, trying to push around these defenders with the pace, using our pace and getting past everybody here. Can we get in the box now? Can we work the ball into the box to feet of our Salsa? We tried to pass it, I think, or had a shot then. I wasn't quite sure what was going through my mind, but I couldn't quite convert that one nonetheless. And here comes, here comes Oscar now with the attack. Great opportunity. He's going to let back to Manson. Manson trying to take a touch and a shot. Can't quite get it out of his feet. And we're coming into the 85th minute now. Here's a great run there from Al Salsa. Such an opportunity. Lays off to Manson by accident. I didn't mean to ask for that. And we've been tackled there with Oscar trying to win the ball back. Here comes Manson now. 90th minute. Little breakaway here. Al Salsa's gone central. Can Manson get in the box? No, he can't. Been tackled there. But the game is finished, guys. That's 1-0 to Chelsea. Thiago with the goal. Manson with the assist to get that goal. Chelsea fans are happy here at home today. They've gone and got themselves the win that we needed. And we're going to head out of this game now with another three points on the table in the Europa League. Here we are now, though, back in our new BMW i8, heading off home, where we're going to park up and get into our new garage alongside our Ferrari, as you can see them parking up. And there's our Ferrari, there's our BMW, some really nice cars we've got going on. And as you can see, we're coming into this Premier League fixture against Norwich. We're currently sitting seven, second place tied top with Tottenham, and the goal scorer is man Hazard sat in third place with four goals, and... Also on this sheet, Manson standing fifth with two assists and Costa's got two assists as well. We just got a text here and it's actually from our manager. Turns out he's going to rest me for the upcoming game versus Norwich to save me, as you can see there, for the Middlesbrough game next week, which is the big cup game, I think, in round four. So I said, that's fine. That's all good. No problems whatsoever. I'm looking forward to playing in the cup. I really want to play these cups and push on through that. This Premier League can take a bit of a break for a week for me to get my stamina back. And as you can see there, our next game will be against Middlesbrough in the AFL Cup on the 29th of October after this game here, which we're going to sim now against Norwich. So Norwich away, uh, Chelsea away to Norwich here. And instead of me, Cotuado has been started and they've got Zaza, Hazard, Hasselic, Loftus-Cheek, Mikel Baba and a few others. And Robbie Brady goes and scores in the 8th minute to go 1-0 up for Norwich, which is quite disappointing. Let's hope we can bring this back. Molumbu goes and gets a yellow card there for Norwich. Baba goes and scores for Chelsea to bring it back to 1-1. Can anyone get a goal in the second half to try and get the win for Chelsea to give us another three points on the table to push, push us top? We'll have to wait and see. 75th minute now, not long left to go in this game, and it's almost over, and there goes the final whistle it finished in the 1-1 uh, there so we only got a point out of that game which might just put us top and as you can see that it hasn't because Manchester under one but Spurs got a draw so they've gone and finished uh not finished uh sat in first and second and here we are now though EFL Cup coming in we've got one place up in the last since the last game we're up to second place overtaking Hazard there about to come into this cup these are the cup goals so far Manston there with six, uh, in sixth place and Loftus-Cheek and Manston both um, Loftus-Cheek in fourth with three Manston in fifth with two assists so we've got, we've got quite a few assists in all competitions so far this season we're actually doing really well they're quite spread out but we're getting the assists nonetheless and a couple of goals to top them off as well so we're actually playing it really really well this season despite not really performing to the manager's expectations and as you can see here we're playing against Middlesbrough and then we might be playing against Sunderland or Newcastle or some of the other teams in the uh, League Cup there but for now we're going to have to focus on this we are myself as a player to watch in this game age of 22 forward for Chelsea from England is Manston there we are up on the right wing Hazard on the left Costa midfield uh, Costa up front sorry the midfielders Pasolic, Mikel and Van Ginkel and the usual defence at the back with the addition of uh, Ibrahim 
Uh, yeah. So here comes the Middlesbrough lineup with Rhodes and Ramirez leading their line. And here we go, about to kick off now, hopefully to get a win and progress through to round five, which will be, I believe, round 16 or round, 30 to, uh, round 16 of the cup. Hopefully we can push on and get, oh, this is round 16, into the quarterfinals, which will be the next one. And hopefully we can push on and get to the, at least get to the finals. I, I, I would love to win my first cup. And if it was the League Cup in England, that would be freaking awesome. But we'll have to see how the rest of the season pans out. If we can continue this good form, it all has to wait and see. But here comes Madsen now on the attack. Fifth minute of the game. Trying to get a goal against Middlesbrough here. Laying it off to Van Ginkle, who just tried to have a shot there. Got blocked by the Middlesbrough defender and nothing quite comes over. Here comes Middlesbrough on the attack now. Working their way in the box. Jordan Rhodes on the ball with the shot. Good save there from Patois to keep him out. 24 minutes played now. Here they come on another attack. Passing around nicely on the edge of the box. Laying it central there. Another shot from Rhodes, I believe. And he can't quite convert that one either. Here we come now. Chelsea on the attack. 26 minutes gone. Here we go. Trying to get a few chances. Laying it off nicely from Costa to Manson. Manson making his way up the right wing. Overtaking all these defenders. Manson with a great chance to go 1-0 up. Here hits the crossbar off the goalkeeper's save. And he goes and collects that second drop down ball as well nothing comes of it after that here we go now 40 minutes in Middlesbrough have had all the possession in this game as you can see they're having a good header there unlucky for him he can't quite convert that header to a goal and they're coming into the half time now with another chance for Middlesbrough they have actually been dominating this game despite the lack of chances from either side and there goes the half time whistle here in this cup round four in the EFL cup currently nil nil here today and hopefully we can push on and get the result and progress through this cup. We need to get a cup win this season. If we get knocked out now, it'll be really disappointing. And it just just doesn't give us as many chances to win a trophy this season. We want to win as many trophies as possible. Do a, do a double, do a treble would be awesome, even with the Premier League. But here we come now on an attack. Costa making his way forward. Manson lays off to Costa. Back to Manson. Manson, can he get a shot away here? Yes, he can. He goes with his left foot. He scores it in the bottom right-hand corner of the net in the 51st minute of this game. Manson goes and scores in this EFL Cup round four match against Middlesbrough. And he's gone and made it 1-0. Great little assist there from Costa, who overlapped. Manson overlapped him. Shot near post. Keeper couldn't get down to it in time. And it's gone right in the bottom corner. Look at that. Keeper just can't get on that good power shot there just to get it past him. And that Spanish archer celebration, as usual, just to top things off. That is Manson's third goal in the EFL Cup this season. He's doing so well. He's got three goals, I believe, two assists in this cup. And he's doing absolutely fantastically this season so far. We've got a good couple of Premier League goals, some Europa League goals and assists as well. And here we come now on another attack. Manson getting it to feet here. Can we get it in the box now? Laying it off to Costa. Costa getting a good quick one-time shot off with a bit of space but can't quite convert it. Here we come now on another attack. Manson making his way into the box with Hazard on the left here getting it into Costa's head. Can't quite get on it and it's been cleared out of play there for a corner. Here comes the corner now. Cross to the back post. Manson getting on the rebound at the edge of the box. Can we shoot? Here we can. It kind of curls in but it doesn't quite make it into the on target area but Otherwise, here we go on another attack. 70 minutes played. Now, Manson laying it off to the right wing, overlapping Oscar. Manson in the box again, back to feet. Manson, can he get across in here to Costa's head? Costa goes and ends it in. It's 2 0 here. This cup tie is really heating up now. It's 2 0 to Chelsea against Middlesbrough. 70 second minute played. Diego Costa goes and scores that header. Manson with a great first time chip cross into the box there. Great power header on the run from Costa to overpower his defender. Headed into the top right hand corner of the net. Conte is a happy man here. We've gone 2-0 up. It looks like we're progressing through to the quarterfinals of this cup. I believe the quarterfinals next. And we are just going to hopefully push on after this result. What a game it's turning out to be. Madsen with a goal and then an assist. Costa with a goal and an assist as well. Helping each other out then. Really linking up nicely. David Luiz on the ball now. 77 minutes played. The Manson. Manson trying to lay it there to Van Ginkel. Can't quite get it away. But Manson gets the ball back after that tackle. Can we get it in the box here? Great little chance. Just getting tackled by the Middlesbrough defender. Getting a block in there as well. But can't do anything after the third attempt. Manson getting up the right wing here. Getting a great through ball there into this perfect bit of space. He just ran into onside as well. Cutting central. Can we lay it off to anyone here? Manson making his way forward. Costa's sitting really close to me. Too close. And it really put me off then. Costa just kept stopping and starting. And couldn't decide what he was going to do. But here we go on another attack now can we get this into the box Manson turning in the box great chance to shoot here we go oh unlucky for Manson good save from the goalkeeper then getting it to feet here's Manson heading it to Costa Costa lays it into the edge of the area having a shot healed Diego Costa unlucky with that last attempt though but we've gone and won the fourth round 
of this EFL Cup fixture and we've gone and won it 2-0 Manston with a goal Manston with an assist Diego Costa with a goal and Diego Costa with an assist really helping each other out then Eden has I couldn't quite do anything of much significance in that game but he was generally a team player and helped us get the result we needed five shots from Manston only one goal but that's okay because we got the result we needed and we're just heading out of the stadium now and as you can see there we won 2-0 and the, uh, Newcastle won uh, Wolves won 1-0 won Tottenham won and the other side hasn't really played yet except for Blackburn who beat Arsenal 2-0 which is a good to see Arsenal being knocked out and as you can see now in our next episode guys we're going to play playing against Southampton so please stay tuned because that's going to be a pretty interesting game against Southampton down in uh, the south of England and then we're going to be heading off to Vadas where or they might be home I believe but well, we're going to be playing them in the second tie of the Europa League at home which is going to be an interesting game to get another three points on the table. But for now, guys, please like, share, and subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you in the next episode.